Guys, give us some spice. Give us some spice. Quick, come on. Over here. Come on, Paul. Come on. I'm just going to hold that for I'm just going to hold that for you. I'm going to pick the sword. Quick, get in the car. Quick, get in the car, George. Let's go. Quick. Start fighting. Move from back. Start fighting. Ask one of the security guards outside of the ground where are the local toilets. He pointed in the direction of a tunnel and I can see the pitch, the actual football pitch, just beneath or further on within the tunnel. I walked in the direction of the tunnel, continued past several security officers and found myself actually behind one of the goals on the pitch where England had just played. I continued walking past more security officers and found myself in the, the tunnel from where the players emerged. I could see the England dressing room sign towards the right. No one at this point had asked me any questions or stopped me. I said to him, David, we spent a lot of money coming out here. That was a disgrace. And what are you going to do about it? He looked at me in surprise and stunned. He didn't know what to say. No, but in the meantime, we had a discussion uh, with all the security responsible persons uh, at Cape Town to make sure that it cannot happen again. I mean, uh, I agree that it's amazing that this guy was able to go through seven different persons and no one asked for his accreditation or have checked if uh, he has an accreditation or not. Uh, so we have uh, worked on immediately to make sure that it cannot happen again.